Hey guys, Al2 here, and I'm back with uh, part two of, you know, how I like to go ahead and uh, break in these uh, one-fifth scale two-cycle engines. So if you didn't see part one, you might want to go back and, and take a look at that. It sort of uh, explains sort of the methodology that I use and, you know, sort of getting the engine ready and how I mix the fuel and all that. So with all that being said, let's go ahead and let's get started with uh, part two. All right, guys, everything's cooled down. I'm going to get ready to do the second uh, heat cycle. I think I have figured out where this oil was uh, leaking from, and I think this this piece of uh, rubber, I don't know that it's rubber, but it's a tubing that connects the header to the exhaust part. I believe it was, um, these aren't tight. These aren't that tight. These are hard to get tight. So I don't know if uh, these are going to hold up. I might have to get clamps, but I believe it was just very fine spraying out of the edge and leaking down onto here. So um, I'm gonna cut these, I'm gonna put new wraps on, I'm gonna heat this thing up and get it real warm. We're gonna heat this engine up anyway to get it started again for our heat cycle. So I'm gonna do that, cut these off, and then we're gonna reattach them, new ones. And uh, See if I can get them tighter. Go ahead and get our heat gun out. And heat that thing up. So I'm pretty sure that's where the oil was coming from, and I think a lot of it was just early on. I don't think. Um, you know, that three-in-one oil that I put in there um, to lube up the engine before we even pulled it for the first time. I think a lot of that's what came out initially. So we'll see here the second, second time. And see if we can get these on. go with the first one. And the second one. Oh, we'll see. See if that's going to be tight enough or not. It certainly looks tighter to me, but whether it is or not, I whether it is or not, I don't know. Now, I know you guys don't have a pulling tool like that, but um, I don't think you need it if you heat that up. I think that's going to be good enough, and you can pull them tight. All right, let's heat up our engine. Get ready for uh, break in cycle number two. Let's have a measure here. Hundred sixty degrees. Two oh one. All right, let's get her primed up. Get air out of there. All right. I don't even know if I'm going to. 
choke it this time, guys. Second pull. We're right up on a second pull. minutes I'm gonna go uh, rev it up a little bit to, you know kind of blow the pipe out a little bit and then uh, we're gonna shut it off and let it cool down Zone. Running pretty rich, so all right. Uh, I'm gonna let it cool down. We'll check back and uh, I'm gonna reposition that rubber hose bushing again. It is definitely leaking out of the side of that, so I'm just gonna probably take that spring off that pipe and um, see what's up with that and then. Uh, heat cycle three and heat cycle four and uh, should be ready to uh, run it after that. 